This is Paulina Kriemen and we are right ahead of KSW 75 and with me I have Jan Lias who's about to have his third performance here in the organization. Welcome again and how does it feel to be here at another part of Poland? You are quite a traveler here. Yeah, yeah, thank you for having me. I'm feeling like, yeah, I'm really discovering Poland every time it's a different city. So, yeah, I'm, uh, it's cool because I've never been before. And since I came to KSW, I was introduced to the country and its people and everything. Yeah. You seem to be a great ambassador of MMA uh, in your country while having your successes here. Um, tell me, does it affect your life uh, since you're here um, in any major aspect while you're in Luxembourg? Uh, not really. I just keep doing my, my thing, um, you know, train, eat, sleep, repeat and uh, focus on getting better and improving my career. But yeah, in Luxembourg, the MMA scene is really small, so it's not like I have a mainstream support or anything. But the community, the MMA, the martial arts community, I think they, they know that we are working hard. And they, yeah, I see a lot of, especially with the young people, they are coming up, they're getting motivated. There's more and more amateur fighters, so that's uh, nice to see. Exactly. So bearing in mind your record, you're eight and one. So when it comes to being in KSW, you're two and zero, oh, uh, which is a great. Um, two of your wins were via unanimous decision. So I guess you have the hunger for the finish, or isn't it? Yes, yes. I mean, I'm a I'm a finisher. Uh, all my professional fights were finishes, except for the ones in KSW. So it it eats a bit at me, to be honest. Um, I really want to finish. I think uh, the last fight, I almost, there was a few occasions where I could have finished. I made a few mistakes. But yeah, I'm always uh, looking for the finish, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, this uh, fight that you're ahead of um, is going to be uh, against another um, debutant because you've also had one before, like Oskar Szpaniak also had his yeah. debut back then. Um, so any thoughts, particular thoughts of him? Uh, did you do any particular research? Yeah, I watched uh, all of his fights. Uh, that was uh, first because the other fighters usually didn't find a lot of materials, but him, yeah, I could find all the fights. Um, yeah, he's an okay fighter. He, uh, what, what struck me most was that he's a, I think he's a patient fighter. He's a, I think he's a counter fighter. So that's something to watch out for. Um, but yeah, I think uh, it's, uh, it's going to be okay. Okay. And um, bearing in mind that you are in a very active um, fighter, so it's like your third uh, performance this year, which is impressive. I guess your health is really like on point. Do you have no injuries whatsoever and it allows you to be a very frequent fighter? Yes, I'm very active and I want to be active. That's really, I think that's really important. And I do take care of my body. I try to listen to my body. I'm not the guy who like overtrains all the time. I try, I think compared to, you always have little injuries and stuff, but I think compared to other people, I get away with a lot more stuff because I, yeah, my body says stop. I'm taking a step back. Um, yeah. And I mean, yeah, I had uh, three fights. This is my fourth fight this year. My third fight with KSW. And yeah, who knows, maybe if I get a good victory, I can ask for fourth fight this year. <laughs> right, fair enough. So we're looking forward and don't forget to turn on via play with uh, Jan being on a card. And if you're abroad of Poland, you can also turn on kswtv.com. And now you can invite all your fans to watch you performing on Friday. Yes, and thank you very much for having me to all the Polish fans. I uh, appreciate it very much, all the little messages I get. And um, yeah, come and watch the fight. And uh, yeah, I hope uh, I'll get to finish this time. Thank you so much for the talk and the high five. Thank you. Thank you.